Welcome back to the conversion stack. We got a new team member in today, Tyler Davis. Pumped to have you. Hey guys. And today we are talking the Google toll. Um, and I defined that on how Google took control of your budget by owning last touch attribution. Really, really fun topic. So jump in, check us out on all your favorite podcasting platforms and let's dive in. All right, last episode, we did the stack stat. Stack stat. My second favorite segment behind your favorite segment and mine. Mm -hmm. Bad advice. Nice. Bad advice. So, Tyler, um, as amazing of a marketer as you are, I've been doing this for a little bit longer than you. <laughs> so, I am here to use my wise wisdom and give you some bad advice. Wise wisdom, huh? Yep. All right. So, I really want to focus on Google because I was doing an analysis and saw that our Google leads in our Google pipeline closes at a faster rate than everyone else. Wait, uh, didn't check whether I'm sitting down yet. You said you want to spend everything on Google, the entire budget? I mean, it's just the fastest pipeline that we get through the system. It's really speeding up our, our sales velocity and it's just a really strong channel. Um, so, so that's what we should focus on. You gave it away, right? We gave it away. This segment's called bad advice. Um, but this is advice that most people don't think is bad, right? Yeah. I mean, it's 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 done commonly in mm -hmm. the industry. Uh, it's, it's our industries that we work with, and I think if you're give if you're to give me bad advice on where to spend money, that's the worst advice you could give somebody, right? <laughs> and why why is that? Um, you know, I, uh, sales velocity is an awesome metric, and it's honestly it's even rare that people are tracking that metric. But the reason your Google ad sales velocity is going to be faster than any other channel is because it's very high intent, last touch attribution. So that person might have been in market for a year mm -hmm. and now they're at the final stages and they went and searched for your brand and they're ready to get on a sales call and drive action, right? So they're, yeah. they're jumping on that demo call, they're going through the buyer's journey and if your product and is what they're looking for, they're gonna buy. Mm -hmm. um, so, but again, it ignores conversion of Google Ads, it ignores everything else that's going on in, in that platform and it's mm -hmm. just looking at the sales velocity and we don't wanna look at sales velocity in that manner. Mm -hmm. Um, and then again, if we do make a harsh decision, like just throw it all in Google at that sense, it's actually going to kill the front of the buyer's journey and the sales velocity is actually going to slow yeah. down because now you're just getting the, the bottom of funnel shopper that's clicking all the ads and total totally. ads trying to decide what's best for them. Let's make this practical for our listeners. Say I'm a average SaaS company with some mm -hmm. software to sell, yeah. have average brand rec, you know, I'm not bottom of the barrel, but I'm doing okay. Mm -hmm. um, my product's good. It's not the best on the market, but it's good. Yeah. Um, I want to engage in full funnel marketing. How do I split up my budget? How much should I actually put on Google search if mm -hmm. I have decent brand rec? Mm -hmm. um, man, that's a tough question, but if you're in middle of the, of the, middle of the, what do you call this here? Industry, right? Yeah, middle, middle. of the industry um, solution, you really need to define your niche and your value prop. Mm -hmm. And to do that, it's not gonna be Google, right? So that's a perfect argument. Like, hey, we need to be putting a significant amount of our budget in finding our little island away from the top dogs in an industry like and that. then winning in that world, right? I think that is a perfect example for we, the market leaders, the sales forces of the world, yeah. can, everyone already, the virus journey has already happened. They can just mm -hmm. make sure they're getting that last click so the random competitor doesn't get you in the, in the end. Yeah. Um, but everyone else doesn't have that luxury. And that's, that's a really good way to look at it.